What's up guys? You're watching the Sean Nicholas channel. I have my 70th anniversary cars out on display. That's right. We're going to add some more cars to the collection, which is really cool. They're coming out with some really cool castings and cars for the 70th anniversary. We're seeing collectors models. We're seeing basic and guess what? We're also seeing the first moving parts 70th anniversary car. That's right. Right there on the back. It's got the 70th anniversary badge right there and it's got that same theme as the basic with the orange on the wheels really cool and that matte gray um, also something i found that you guys should be aware of if you are collecting the 70th anniversary matchbox look out for this awesome five pack it's got a white top on here usually it's orange on the top here but yeah these are 70th anniversary cards you can see the 70th anniversary badge right there on that rear right there and so forth um, really cool set. So if you're collecting them, don't miss this five pack. We're going to open it up and we're going to add it to the collection. Um, two of these cars in this mix have the orange on the wheels, but I don't know why these have the silver. So, um, and it still has the 70th anniversary badge on it right there. So definitely part of the 70th anniversary set. Let's go ahead and start off with the moving parts though. Um, this is the 1956 Morris minor convertible. Um, really cool. It's got an opening hood. Let's go ahead and get this thing cracked open and add it to the 70th anniversary collection. Um, and also on mix two, I believe it is for the 70th anniversary cars moving parts. They're all going to be orange. And there's also a chase to look out for, which is an orange Range Rover. And on the box, it'll say chase. There is the motor. Let's go ahead and get a little zoom in here. Check that out. Really nice details on that motor there. It's got a green head on the motor and it's got some gray details in there. You can see like an intake. Um, you can see the hose going to the um, radiator. Really cool. Nice details on there. You can see those nice headlights. It's got black wheels with that orange trim on it. It's got the matte gray on it. It's got the 70th anniversary badge for Matchbox on that rear trunk. It says MBX 70th on that trunk as well. MBX stands for Matchbox. It's got a black interior, clear window tint, and a gray base. And that is the first moving parts for 2023, the 1956 Morris Mini. And we're gonna add that to the collection right next to the collector's models. Let's go ahead and move on to this awesome five pack. Um, in this five pack, we got the MBX Mission Helicopter, the 1994 Chevy Caprice Classic, the 1989 Chevy Blazer 4x4, the GMC Wrecker, and the Pierce Aero XT Fire Engine. So they're mostly working vehicles, you know, police and a uh, tow rig and a fire truck, and we got that helicopter on the top. Um, so let's go ahead and this, get this thing cracked open and add it to the collection. I usually just take a butter knife to it and uh, try to get up in there. So one of these edges are usually, um, you know, already almost picked through. Here we go. I'm gonna go ahead and see how I just peel that like that. And then I just stick the butter knife in there. Just slide it along. And that's how I usually get it open pretty clean without having to cut the box because I like to keep the box nice. Uh, sometimes I like to keep this car stored in there, but this is not going to be stored in this uh, case. I'm just going to keep it in my 48 count case so I can have all the collector models together. Voila, there we go. We got it out of the box. Um, let's go ahead and check out that MBX uh, Mission Helicopter, which is really cool. Um, it's got the 70th anniversary badge right there, right behind the cockpit, I believe you'd call it. And there it is. It's spinning. Wow. That's been really nice. I'm surprised, honestly. So it got like, see how the other cards have the orange and this one has like a yellow, like I want to say like highlighter yellow look to it. Um, so that's a little bit different, um, on these 70th anniversaries, but if you're collecting them all, you're definitely going to want to add this to the collection. Let's go ahead and put the helicopter to the side right here. And let's go ahead and move on to the vehicles part of this mix. Um, first up, we have the 1994 Chevy Caprice Classic. And this is a police car, not the first police car that we've seen for 70th anniversary. We've also seen the Fox Body, part of the Matchbox Collectors. 
And also we've seen the Ford Interceptor. So not the first set of police cars for 70th anniversary, but hey, the police cars are adding up and you're gonna have a full fleet by the end of this uh, year. It has a blue window tint with the white interior and you can see the laptop inside the interior, which is like a cool little detail that they added to the car. Um, the Matchbox 70 year badge is on that rear fender. It says Metro Police on the side and it's got the orange and black wheel, just like we're seeing for the rest of the year for the 70th anniversary cars. There's two cars in this mix that don't have the orange. Instead, they have chrome. And also this one has a chrome base. So really cool. Let's go ahead and park this up next to that Morris Miner. And uh, let's move on to something really cool. At least I think it's really cool. The Chevy Blazer 4x4. So really cool that they added the Chevy Blazer 4x4. It's got a little hitch there on the back so you can uh, attach it to whatever and tow it. Um, this thing is jacked up and looks sweet and it doesn't have those orange uh, rim around the wheels like the other ones that we saw. It has a black base, blue window tint, just like that Caprice with a white interior. It's got the 70th anniversary on the bed of the truck. It has a black front grill with a winch and it also has a black rear bumper. So that is the Chevy Blazer 4x4. This is really cool. Very happy to have it. This 70th anniversary is really starting to grow on me. Let's go ahead and move on to the tow truck. That's right, this is the GMC Wrecker. That's what we're calling this. It has a yellow window tint with black interior and it's got the Matchbox 70th anniversary right behind that side window. And it's got a black base with a black front bumper. And this one has the chrome wheels, unlike the most of the cars just set that have the orange wheels. So this is the GMC Wrecker. Let's go ahead and park it up like it is towing that Audi away and out of here because he is not supposed to be parked there. Let's move on to the Pierce Aero XT fire engine. And this is the final car part of that five pack and the final car in this video. So really cool, it's got the 70th year anniversary right behind the cab um, on that back part of the fire engine. It's got a blue window tint with a white interior and it has the passenger and driver's side windows down. And this one has the orange wheels, unlike those chrome wheels on the last two cars that we saw. And it has a light gray base. Also, something I did notice is on the bottom, see that elephant right there below the matchbox? What does that mean? If you know exactly what that means, drop it in the comments. I would love to hear what you guys have to say. I've seen several people on forums trying to figure out exactly what that elephant means and uh, never came up with an answer. So if you guys know, drop it in the comments, please. I would love to know. So that is the final car, part of that five pack. And also we got that awesome Morris Mini moving parts, the first 70th anniversary moving parts for this set. Um, the collection's really growing. What do you guys think about it? I think it looks phenomenal, it's really cool. There's gonna be so many cars by the end of the year. I'm so excited for this set. I wanna see them all and it's just so exciting. Matchbox is really cool. So let me know in the comments which one's your favorite and don't forget to like and subscribe.